create a landing page for crypto ERC20 token sell. Hit enter. It's going to generate the landing page for my cryptocurrency. And it's going to give you an idea that what kind of UI component you're going to include. I'm making this video to remind you that how the development is going to be happen in the future and how you can take the advantage of this AI model and implement it in your development process. No matter what type of developer you are, whether you are a blockchain developer or a web2 developer, backend, frontend, smart contract, it's apply for all the developers. So this is really, very important that you have to keep yourself updated. You have to know that what AI models are available in the market, which you can utilize in your development to make things faster and how you can bring more efficient to your work in your development or in your production. So in this video, I'm going to talk about this particular AI, which is really good. And it will help you to generate the UI component, which you can simply copy and paste and use in your project. And it's really, very fast. It's use Next.js and Telvin CSS. So here you can see I'm on the website. I hope I'm going to provide you the link in the description so you guys can come and have a look from your and try to understand and use it and do the experiment in that way you will learn and you will understand that how to write the prompt for this kind of AI model to generate the code so make sure to watch this video till the end to understand things better so here you can see that they have given you this search bar all you have to do is to simply type your prompt and it's going to generate the code for you they have given some category like product category hero section contact form e-commerce dashboard so they have given a bunch of prompts which you can simply select but if you come back here you will find that all the user who have already done already used this particular tool to generate the component so you can have a look at what exactly it's doing so if you talk about this particular prompt if i click on that i can able to see that what this ai model have generated so this is a perfect example of a contact form which we can simply utilize in our project so you can simply click on the code you have to get this particular package and simply copy the entire code and implement in your project so this is the one example if i come back here you will find that they have given a bunch of examples and the best part i like about this ai model that it's write a huge lines of code so if you want to have a dashboard like they have built the dashboard as well they have built the table component as well they have built multiple tables so you can see you will find bunch of i'm going to show you that how you can utilize it you can come back to the features and there you will find that all the component which are features here and you can simply pick those component if you really like to include in your project so you can check that now here is a couple of example which i'm going to explore it so i'll simply click on this product category and let's see what it gives so this is the product category so a list of product category which image name and description you can add more if you want to go with the rating pricing you can add that so let's see what it's generated so if i click on that it's going to take a few time and the component you will get is going to have a next gist and it's going to use the Telvin CS model. You can see the AI is working and it will give you a couple of variation. And that's the best part. It will not give you one static component, but it will also give you a couple of variation which you can pick. And here it's generating three different variation. So if you are not satisfied with the first three, you can simply try to degenerate or you can add more into a prompt and it's going to generate. So this is the component it's generated for the product. You can see how powerful it is. All you have to do is to simply replace the text and the styling, it's everything is good. You can come back here, you can simply copy this entire piece of code. It's so easy. Like if you want to design something like this earlier, we used to spend an hour to first lay out the design or then build the code for that. But right now we can simply give this kind of prompts and it's going to give us the styling. So the more good and brief your prompt is, the better you're going to have the output. So if I want to generate a lightning page for the crypto, like ICO, cryptocurrency, so I can say create a landing page for crypto ERC 20 token sell head enter it's going to generate the landing page for my cryptocurrency and it's going to give you an idea that what kind of ui component you're going to include or you can simply break down the entire landing page into a small component like you can generate the header you can generate the footer you can generate the banner you can generate the body you can generate the sales component that's all instruction you can give and it's going to simply generate it how quickly it's happening in the real time you can simply add more prompt to have a specific so you can see it's give us the details about the like first we have the header this is the logo section we have this is the navigation section we have and this is the very first component it's adding all the details the supply you look how powerful it is so this is the first component it's have generated it's still generating so just wait let's it generate the complete the component adding all the things like kyc scam <laughs> cap head cap that's all it's displaying here so this is the first section. If I scroll down, this is the second one in that you can take the email ID from the user. And this is the footer. You can create as many big as you want. You can simply break down into a small component. And that's what I have realized that when you are giving a specific command, like for example, you want to generate a header section. So give a brief prop that what type of header you want. Then you can do the same thing for the hero section. Then you can do the footer section and the cell section. And that way you will have a better result. You can see this is the simple product they have deployed. 
but it's really powerful it's really powerful like you can generate this kind of code this will save hours of time during a development so it's my suggestion to all of you guys definitely if you are a blockchain developer or a front-end developer or back-end developer you have to start using this ai model it's not always important that you have to build something from scratch you have to take the help of this ai model to build the product as fast as you can because the quicker you will build the more project you will have and it will work at the same time simultaneously so this is very important to all of you guys you can see this is the dashboard they have built it's pretty amazing you can use the same prompt to see what exactly they have built and see it's powerful like we have a different card section on over effect we are getting all this data so this is really good i would encourage you that try to find out all the ai models try to pick one this one is really good i really like it i use chat 4.5 the upgraded word that one is really powerful and that's helping to generate the if next level of result when it's come to designing my ui so this is what i would suggest you definitely trump and try this out spend one hour try to understand the architecture how to write a better prompt because in future writing prompt is going to be one of the skills you must have if you are a developer because if you want to generate code you have to know how to write to generate a consistent code on the same styling point that's the very important skills no matter what type of code you are generating or what type of video or images you are generating you have to know that how you can maintain the consistency which can relate from start to end that one is very important so that's the only thing from my end i hope you guys have got an idea that how you can utilize this tool so still if you still have any doubt any query do let me know in the comment section and if you want to master blockchain development then you can definitely come back here in the in the course section there we will master every single thing about the next years delvin css smart contracts solidity programming language that's all you will master and this will teach you every single thing which you have to know as a blockchain developer. So that's the only thing from my end. If you have any idea, if you have any question, do let me know in the comment section. I'll definitely try to help you with that. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.